everyone. We're excited to start this new journey with all of you. And thank you for everyone that's been showing us um, support. In this first video, um, we're just gonna do a little introduction about ourselves and the Q and A. Start things off, I want to introduce um, ourselves. Um, my name is Mauro and that's my wife. What's your name? <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, her name is Leila. We're gonna start the Q and A now. My wife's gonna read off the questions from her phone and we'll both um, answer. All right, so we're gonna start with the questions now. Um, so yeah. Tell us how you guys met and what made you think he or she was the one. Um, so we met um, in 2018, June of 2018. June. Or July, I mean, sorry. And um, we met um, while we were working together. Um, and that's how I kind of think started. Um, how do we know that? How do how did I know that she was the one? Well, like, I don't think we all know like exactly that that person's the one, um, but I think it's just like how we started talking and stuff. Like um, each and every day, like you kept falling in love with that person and I'm pretty sure you feel it in you that that person um, is the one because if you don't fall in love every day or something like that you obviously don't it won't it won't ever happen it won't ever work I don't think I, mean, I don't know what you think but Mm. Well, I kind of agree with him. Um, it doesn't, um, you don't know right away if that person is, um, I guess, the right one for you. Um, yeah, was the one for you. Um, I think it just goes days, goes um, day by day, and just how you um, interact with that person. Um, it just takes time and then you have to see where it takes you and if you guys are actual if you guys are actually compatible for each other it's not just about texting and well yeah kind of talking in a way because I, I feel like texting and talking us, in person we we, it would be months and months until we would oh yeah like, when we started it we hardly ever saw each other like well like, even recently even like, recently like when we barely barely because we barely started we barely started living together like in october no. september no august no august. oh august but like alone alone like without her without at my mom's house i think it was since september like early september no yeah well, early september yeah but anyways um but before like no, like middle, mid September is when we started to live by ourselves, and that itself was a big challenge because we barely started to see each other like often, often more often than we were. Like and in April, mm -hmm. April, uh, which was a big change for us because we would go. We would go literally like months without seeing each other we, right? we, we wouldn't even would, facetime each other we would even not even a call <laughs> not even it's a call sometimes yeah a call maybe once or twice in like Two three weeks me, yeah. yeah but yeah i mean that's it pretty much um, but yeah um i don't think you know exactly when that person is the one for you i think it just takes time and how you get along with that person um those people that say that it's love at first sight i don't think it's no, I, don't, I don't i don't really i don't believe in that because sometimes. you don't i don't i don't think it's true because how are you gonna fall in love with the person that you saw maybe you the the physical yeah is what attracts you but at the end of the day it's not just physical because the physical is gonna end exactly. but i guess what you have inside it doesn't end well not i guess it just doesn't end mm -hmm. okay right, we move on to the next question um 
how did you guys meet when I answer that? Um, what was your guys' reaction finding out you got you were gonna be parents? Um, our reaction to us being parents. Um, well, it wasn't a big surprise. Yeah, it wasn't a surprise. Because we already we kind of already knew like that I was like pregnant because I was not. There was a lot of changes that I didn't know why, uh -huh. and then it took a while for it to actually pop up that I was pregnant. Um, the only reason I think it wasn't we weren't surprised is because we weren't really like you guys taking care of each other, um, um, and it just kind of happened, I guess. But I think the only reaction we had was that we were both happy. I mean, other than that. Not really surprised or any of it. I mean, we're both pretty pretty happy, and just can't wait till our baby's here. How old are you guys? Um, I'm 22. I just turned 22 in December, and she's 20. Going to be 21 in August. So that's that. And then the next question says, "What keep you guys um, motivated?" I think what keeps me motivated is that um, I have a baby on the way and I just want to provide everything I can for him and not just for him but my wife as well so um, I want them to be living good and I mean that's most, mostly mainly what motivates me just them two to keep going forward with life. Yeah um, I think for me it's the same thing. Um just we we have to keep each other motivated because we obviously have a baby on the way um, we're bringing well i'm bringing a new life to this world so i would just say that family is what keeps us motivated and each other as well it says what are some goals you guys have for 2021 so starting the year i i don't think we any of us had any goals set um but I think this this YouTube thing is um, gonna be one of like like mainly our I guess you could say a goal now um, to just keep up with it um, like just do content for you guys I don't I don't know what what to I don't really know anything about YouTube much but I mean we're just starting off so I mean that's about it and then. <coughs> I don't know what what else you want to say or what. Well, just YouTube to see where it takes YouTube, us. YouTube takes us. I mean, um, a lot of people don't really, I guess, have faith. Yeah. In us, but I mean. Well, not just that. I mean, I think it's just like us too, because at first we were really like. Well, we started off with the TikTok. Yeah. <laughs> um, I th I think it's just getting used to stuff like this because people really don't. I think here in Hermeson, just people, like, put each other down. Yeah, I think it's just because people are just haters, I mm -hmm. think. And, like, that's it, mainly. Um, but I think, yeah, YouTube and just, I guess, starting our family. Mm hmm And then it says, um, ¿Cuándo van a ser um, tu bebé? Um, so, so this, for those that don't, yes. Um, so, um, for those that speak Spanish, um, we can also speak Spanish. So we'll, um, we'll answer this one in Spanish. Just so the question is, when is your when is your baby going to be born? Um, our due date is April. 11th. April eleventh is when our baby is going to be due. So, cuando van a ser tu bebé? Um, nuestro bebé, um, van a ser. Well, tiene la fecha el 11 de abril. Entonces va a nacer en es, por ahí en esos, en esos tiempos. Um, no. says, um, the next question is, ¿Quién manda a quién? Also, I'm so happy for you guys. Um, well, thank you for, for that um, good comment. Um, we appreciate it. Um, and ¿Quién manda a quién? Um, <laughs> I mean, I, I don't know. I don't think either of us 
Armandones. Armandonas. Like, I... I don't, I don't, I don't think, I think it's even in a way, like, we tell each other what to do, but not in a way. Well, we don't really tell each other, we ask. Like, like, here at the house, we ask each other, like, hey, can you do this, can you do that? Other than that, um, we don't, when we go out and do something, we just ask, like, hey, or we don't ask, we just kind of, like, in a way, kind of suggest it, like, hey, I'm gonna do this, and. Pretty much kind of just tell them where you're going or what you're going to do. But other than that, we don't really ask each other anything because at the end of the day, we decide what to do and we don't control each other at all. I mean, well, sometimes we, some stuff we obviously have to. Sometimes we obviously have to talk well, about most things. of the, most everything yeah. we have to let each other know because mm -hmm. we're not just one person anymore. We're, we're family now, yeah. so it's a little different. I mean, not that I tell you, you can't do this or you yeah. can't do that. And he can't tell me that either because at the end of the day, he's not, he doesn't own me and I don't own him either. Exactly. <clears throat> okay, so. the next question is... Um, when did you guys start dating and why? Well, we can already answer that. Yeah, we can already answer that. I mean, it's... we started, well, not even dating because honestly, we we never really like. I actually never actually asked her, um, but I don't know. I just everything just happened. Like I don't know how to how to explain it to you guys, but we don't. I mean, we go off off of the day that we started talking yeah like texting but um if like when did we like actually start talking i think it would be like when we were working together no mm -hmm. like july like late july no it was mid mid -July. mid july like let's say like 16 17 but and um why why did we start talking well i see because it was not that we had to talk at work but like we were working together and then yeah I guess we just... Got I mean, I was the one that, like... I was the one that initiated everything, like... I think I was... I don't know what, what it was that I just, like... Like... Every day, I would I would just want to talk to her, like... I don't know, it was just... It wasn't, like... Any, I didn't have any feelings, I guess, towards her at the moment, but... It just... I just wanted to talk to her, I guess, and then... Um... That's how everything started... Mainly. But it says why. But why? Why? I don't think it... I, there's, think I don't have a really a reason why we started talking. Like, it's just... Like how we said, well, the first question is that we don't... Like, we don't know if that's the person that's going to be the one you're going to be with forever. Because, I mean, forever is a strong word. I mean, I know that you get mad because you say that things are going to last forever. But that's just that's a strong word because we don't know after we're done making this video we don't know what can happen like well yeah that, that's it's just what they just, it's just life in general I not mean, just because like oh like i'm not gonna stay with him because this and that or because i want to go with someone else no i don't mean it that way but i mean it like um i think she means it in a way that we're not guaranteed to be to be with life with life in general like and it's true i mean that's just how life is, I guess. And I mean, it's sad and scary, but I mean, yeah, we can say forever, but we, we in our plans, we say forever, but we don't know what's going to happen. Okay, well, later. Mm -hmm. next question, I guess, because. <laughs> um, when y'all meet, um, we are answer that. Any kids in the future? Well, kids in the future, well, since, yeah, we have, she's pregnant and it's coming already so there's one i mean i don't know if i don't i don't know i don't have any i don't have any i haven't put any thought into um another baby but i mean i think it's just we're just kind of seeing what after how what um happens with this one and i mean it would be nice to have another baby just well it's hard too. it's hard though yeah i would understand it's, i understand it's, it's probably really hard to have a baby but I mean, I don't think it's something that we can't um, 
handle it. Handle, I mean. But even now that we don't have it here, like, well, we have it, I have it with me all the time, but now that it's not, um, like, here physically with us, um, well, yeah, fit, yeah, I guess physically, I, th I think it is because it's inside of me. Yeah. Um, I think it's just going to be a little, hard. It's going to be different after it's. It's hard not having him here with us because we still have to, like, I have to be taking care of myself. Um, I think even then, though, you after it's, you're still gonna have to be taking care of yourself. You know, like, it's just it's gonna be everything's gonna be different. And I, I mean, I, I, I just, we'll we'll see after this one. I mean, it's just it's too soon to tell what 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 um. If we will have another baby or not. Okay, next uh, question. Next um, question. First date. Uh, the first date um, was... September 1st. September 1st. Of 2018. Of 2018. Where was it at? Oh, it wait, was, never mind. Oh, I didn't say where, but... Anyways, we'll tell you guys some... Um, but we'll... No? Yeah, I and, guess. So we went to the movies um, September 1st. Typical of going to the movies. <laughs> well... <laughs> My plans really weren't to, because I was the one, obviously, to <laughs> to ask, um, but I had asked her, um, like, probably a month before, um, if she just wanted to go out, like, get ice cream, or, like, get some tea, or... Well, technically, we were hanging out at my nephew's party. Yeah, uh, but, like, you kind of like ignored 15. me. No, I did not ignore you. You went inside, and then... And anyways, <laughs> we went to the movies when we were like alone. I guess you can say that's that's an actual date, you know. And um, but um, yeah, we went to the movies, but someone decided to be like two we hours late. Go to him too late. <laughs> anyways, yeah, she was late, and but it was it was still pretty cool. I mean, I had I spent time with her, and it was it was nice. Um, but yeah, we had to wait a whole another no, not even a month, cause then you went to my yeah, place. like yeah, it was like a month almost. No, cause my niece's um party was that month too. That was in October, wasn't it? No, it was in September. Uh, anyways, it was like late uh, September, so. Well, those two September and uh, September and October is the days that we seen each other, and then after that we didn't see each other for like November, until after Thanksgiving. So it was it was tough at first, like we wouldn't see each other much. Um, um, pet peeves for each other of each other. Um, you can go first. Mm -hmm. Then you can go. Um, I think a pet peeve of mine is that um, she kind of like ignores me when like she's on her phone. And I mean, I think it's a, with everyone, but I don't. I really don't like when people are on their phones and like you are having a conversation with them and like you ask them something and. Like they're like what what and then like they keep they keep like just not really paying attention to it and it's not that I don't pay attention it's just that I think I'm too focused on what I'm doing and she doesn't leave the phone that's the thing that I don't like I pay attention but I don't leave the phone and you say I don't pay attention yeah um, but I feel like he just wants me to put the phone down so I can have my his I can give him my full attention but I still pay attention. Even even though some half the stuff I don't. He, she doesn't remember like what I ask her sometimes. Like if if you have trouble remembering what I asked you just five seconds ago, then that's a problem. Mm -hmm. But um, another thing is like, she, um, she thinks every shirt or, or clothes, anything she wears is dirty instantly. Like she puts it on for like she tries it on or something. And she, I don't she, try it on no. Pretty much. No. Okay, like she wears. If for, I go like, to the store and I have. A, a sweater on I have to take it off just because I don't know what is she's it's it's like I think she seems it seems like she's like a germaphobe or something but like <laughs> but no it's like I don't know it's weird because like and he doesn't he'll just like, sleep with whatever he gets like if if this shirt like if I if I put it on to sleep with um I can go the next day and wear it the whole day but she can't do that. She if she just if it's barely washed and everything, and she puts it on to go to sleep, she takes it off in the morning and she wears a new outfit. Well, much. you even think it's weird because when I wake up, I try to change. Yeah, like I I don't know. I I feel like it's 
I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't do that. That's and why. Jackets, that's, it's the same thing. Like she wore like a, she wears like a, those uh, windbreakers, and obviously those don't get dirty. Like I don't know how you can get them dirty, unless you like spill like water or juice or whatever you drink or you eat, and it gets dirty. But other than that, like I don't think those even get dirty easy. Like I don't see the point of washing them so often. But I mean, she does it, and. That's like literally, I don't have any other thing that she does that bothers me or the pet peeve. And me? And well, I think she has a shut tent, so. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> um, I think mine is that you don't close the curtain when you shower. Because <laughs> every, every time he's done showering or if he's doing something in the tub, like washing his shoes i guess like he doesn't close it oh and another thing is too is that whenever you clean your shoes or wash your shoes or whatever you leave it all dirty oh my goodness and the same thing when you brush your teeth like the toothpaste is all over you don't even like rinse it out i do <laughs> no you don't okay, um and when you go to you use the bathroom you don't put the seat down to sit down <laughs> and then something else is that when i clean like you think i clean too much well yeah like we don't have we don't even have a baby yet and she cleans like no one comes to the house and she cleans like like i think i don't know it might, i don't say it's too much but everyone has their opinions but it's it's like unnecessary at the time like to well, me i don't know i I think because I just come from, my mom's just very like, not like, I don't want to say a freak because my sister's going to watch this. But, <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> like. not, not like that she's like crazy about it, but she's just very like a clean person. Like if it was up to her, I think we, the house would be filled with like, like the bleach because she makes, she, we got it from her, but she makes this clean like every day, like. If the bathroom is not cleaned every day, that's that's like a big problem. That's she gets mad the whole day, and then with us, like I'll I I want to clean the bathroom every day, but he's like, why? If it's just us two, I mean, you go to the bathroom every day, so well, you yeah, use but, it. Um, but I, I don't know. I don't. I don't. But anyways, but he does this thing where I will all <laughs> clean, and then no, I'll I'll be like, oh, I'm gonna um. I'm gonna clean and then I'll ask him. But then to... she like gives me an opinion like, like should I mop or should I just wait later or tomorrow? And then so he I, tries. I'll, so I'll, I'll like, ask. Well, might as well tomorrow then... if he... No, but I'll ask him. I'll ask you like, should I mop, or do you want to mop? And then when I say do you want to mop, he tries to convince me to do it tomorrow. <laughs> so then in, we wait. And then I'm like, okay, well tomorrow, you know. And then we never do it. And then. Like you're not saying that our house is dirty. I mean, I'm, I'm, I think. House is like, pretty clean. It's pretty honestly. clean, like pretty, pretty, pretty clean. I mean, I always try to clean, like, um. Well, now towards now towards the end of my pregnancy, I get really tired and I, um, run out of breath. But I, <laughs> we, maintain the house pretty clean. I mean, mm -hmm. it doesn't smell bad, or anything. I mean, um. But yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty clean. Pretty clean. But yeah, that's some of the pet peeves I have from someone over here. <laughs> and then it says, um, what's your most used app? Um, I think my most used app is probably Instagram. And then after that, it's probably TikTok. But I'm mainly not on my phone, like on the social medias. I'm mainly on my phone um, playing games, but that's it. Mm. I don't know about you. What do you think? Snapchat and Facebook, big time, <laughs> and YouTube. Those are the three most used apps for her. She always uses those three. I think Facebook, just because, like, it's not that, that I. No, <laughs> not that I've been a chismosa. It's just that, like, nowadays, like, there's a lot of things happening here. Um, well, yeah, that's true. And especially because, like, I come from not the saying that I I'm a farm girl. 
she, 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 um, she I, never lived like in the city, like where she hears like sirens or she hears cars roaming around or any of that. And she thinks every sound is weird. Like, <laughs> like, like once, um, when it was, when it, he was at work, he was working, um, he was at work and, um, I was alone and, um, I thought someone was like knocking on the window, but it was actually the wind and I was freaking out and I yeah, went to um, call the police, but it, <laughs> but, but it's things like that that scare me because I'm not used to over there where, she where I live, live with my parents. I, the only thing I would hear is the cars and the, um, semis go by and my, um, my dogs and well, my dad's animals. But that's about it. We never, like, except for that time that, like, our neighbors tried to burn their house down. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> yeah. Um, what else? What's the next question? Because you're getting off topic now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're not, we're, we're not even answer the question. But we did. No, that was. The most used that app. It was those three. Oh. <laughs> you went through the whole. I don't know what. Anyways, it was better. Okay. Um, anyways, what? No, wait. If we, it was Snapchat, um, Facebook, and um, YouTube. YouTube. I watch a lot of YouTube. Mm -hmm. um, but now what else? Anyways, <laughs> um, how old are you guys? Well, we're we um, twenty-two that. and twenty. You're 22. I thought you were 23. Hey, <laughs> you forgot. <laughs> yes. Um, what are you, when are you guys gonna collab with um Elian's vlogs? Um, I don't know Elian. Um, he does, but um, um, hopefully, like in my plans, I hope that YouTube we do do big things with um YouTube. I mean, right now we're just starting off, and we don't know what can happen. But I mean, hopefully we can be known i guess just mm -hmm. here in the area well yeah i mean um hopefully yeah we do something big with youtube and um we can kind of make a name for ourselves and yeah we probably could do a little collab with elian vlogs um what's their vlogs about i, think, I mean i think he has a couple videos um on his page so if you guys want to subscribe to his channel, well, we'll Elian, Elian Vlogs, um, we'll, 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 set it, we'll put a link down there so you guys can um, watch his, his videos as well. I think he has just like five, four videos, something like that. But so you guys can follow his his YouTube channel. Um, what's better to cook from <laughs> here or from Mexico? So um, I'll probably just answer that because she hasn't been to Mexico. Um. I think personally, I think the cook from Mexico is a little better, but only because I don't really drink. Um, I mean, I do drink Coke here, but the thing is that over there, it's like I didn't really drink the can ones. I drink the bottle, and I think here there's there is some, but I don't really don't drink that kind. I usually buy like the can ones and so that's the only reason why I say that. The ones in Mexico, I mean, the ones well, here are good too, but... I mean, I've never had the ones from Mexico, but the ones that come in the bottle, those taste different from the ones they can. Exactly. The ones, I think that the ones from the can have more of the, what is it called? The gas. The thing. gas thing. Yeah. Um, and then the ones from um, the... The bottle, though. The bottle, they are just like better and... Um, they I have, think so. I think they're a lot like... Because the ones from the can, they leave like a weird taste. After, yeah, ones, a little bit. Like metal, kind kind of. And then the ones from the bottle, they leave like, I mean, not the best taste, but. Um, Just better, yeah, I guess. But I guess I don't find, and I, I, I've never really like cared just because I, especially now I, <laughs> I can drink a whole pack. All right. Um, how fun. do you make your beard look <laughs> good? Um, well, my beard, it just came in like naturally. I don't do anything to it to make it look like that. I mean, 
shave it off. I'm going to shave it off here pretty soon. Tomorrow. Oh, I'll record it so you guys can see that too. Um, He's um, not going to shave it off. He's been saying that. <laughs> no, I mean, no, it's... He it's, trims it, but... I trim it a lot, but it, I think it's just... Um, I don't know. I, the one day I just went to my barber and he kind of like um, shaped it up a little bit and then it just kind of like started growing in because it wasn't like over here. It, it, it like was patchy and stuff and it just grew in randomly like i don't know it was it was kind of weird it was it surprised me a little bit because i didn't do anything to make it like that um it says um how do you guys feel about talking to the camera um well for me i not i don't like to take pictures like he likes he's more of a like let's take pictures let's take pictures even for our announcement for our baby, for our pregnancy announcement. It was, um, I think it was for me. our wedding pictures. Well, for our wedding pictures, we wanted to take wedding pictures. But um, for the those ones, I think it was him because he's more of a, like, let's take pictures, let's take pictures. Even if, like, we go out to eat to Tri Cities, like. I'll be the one taking pictures of her, like, yeah, and stuff like that. Yeah, but I don't. But, like. I mean, I don't, I don't really care, like, I, about it, but, yeah, I think talking on camera is a little weird. Um, it's just getting used to it, I think. Just because you're, don't, you're not talking to, I think going live is a lot more, like, better because, like, people Because I think actually, people are actually, like, yeah, watching, watching you, you, and then, like, maybe they'll leave a comment, and you're like, oh, what do they say, and then you, like, read it and stuff. But other than that, I don't, I don't, I feel a little awkward talking on camera, but I mean, we're just going to get used to yeah. it, I guess. But once you're up here and talking and like yeah, once the first three minutes, it's kind of like you don't know what to say. And then they it like then you just it goes it just flows with everything like you're just going with it. And then it says, "Who's more shy?" Um, I think we're both shy in a way, but I think um I'm not as shy as her. Like she's really, I think she's more shy. Um. Well, you say that I'm very. Um, what is the word? That you say that I'm not scared to like. You say that. What is it called? Sugarcoating a thing? Like what? How she's trying to say is that she's not scared of people telling her things, but uh, but that's not kind of what I'm, what we're getting at though. Well, yeah, but dude, that's kind of the the question. That's kind of the I question guess. why you're shy. It's not that I'm shy. Well, yeah, I am shy, but a lot of people like he said that when he's first met me, that I was stuck up. Yeah, but I, it's I, not that I'm stuck up. It's just that I just don't like if that person doesn't talk to me like if we're in a, in a place and no one's talking i'm not gonna be the one that first is gonna start the conversation and he knows it like i'll even when i go to his mom's house like his mom doesn't talk to me and i won't talk to her either it's just yeah. like whatever comes up but we don't um i mean i don't talk unless I'm talked to and I know it's kind of rude but that's just the way I am I mean sometimes yeah I don't want to get I don't want to talk to no one but it's just that I don't know how to start the conversation yeah pretty much but what um, is awesome? when and where did you guys meet um well we already answered that when and where did you guys meet we met um when we were working together I and mean, we could have met a couple times because, like, at school, we could have met, but... Well, at school, I only seen you one time. Yeah, I mean, but, I mean, still, we went to school together, so, I mean, we could have seen each other Oh, and sometime. then, because my sisters and his cousins, they're, oh, yeah. they were, they're all, well, I mean, till this day, like, they're not good friends, but... But, I mean, they know each they, other, yeah. they, they'll say hi to each other and stuff, and, I mean, I could have met but her... Back then, like, they were really good friends. I could have met, I could have met her then, but I didn't, and... Um, she just went to my mom's baby shower, which I didn't know about, and I didn't even know that she went. I didn't even see her, actually. Well, because he was too distracted talking to other people. Well, yeah, people that were there. No. <laughs> could, like... <laughs> and then... No, I still remember you were stuck to that phone, like, if they were paying you or something. Well, they were. <laughs> really? I'm just kidding. No, um, and... She went also to my padrino's um, daughter's... Uh, birthday party and she was there too so i and i didn't I didn't, know. I didn't know that he was there until um, i think i told her 
I don't know. I showed you. No, like, I've seen pictures. Oh, I think she. Oh no, yeah, you did tell I me. I show you next. Yeah. Yeah. Um. But that's it. Um, oh, and then I would see him like around town, like sometimes at the store. But um, like. Oh, and then because my mom. Oh, oh, and I worked with her mom like, maybe like four years, and throughout the whole time I worked with her, I only knew that she had two daughters. Oh, and, and then my dad too. And I knew his dad, her dad, and everything. But it's it's kind of weird how they never mentioned like their youngest daughter, like. And I didn't even know, like, it, it was just, it's it's kind of crazy how we met until, like, she had to work there, you know? But other than that, that's kind of... It's kind of, what is it called? Um, they say that if that, that if that, if, if you see that person and then they, like, that person comes back to you, that means that they're meant to be. Yeah, it's true. It's true. But, um, other than that, I think that's it, no? Um... Who's more toxic? Um, I find toxic as a word that like you. I feel like toxic in a way is more like you try to control a person, or you. And that's really bad because like, I mean, I think the only people that should try to control you is your parents. Not even. I don't even think. Well, not them, not parents, like... but like obviously, like you have to follow their rules and. I mean, why do I have to control him if if I trust him and everything? I mean, not even, not even, even if I didn't trust him, there's no reason for me to to control him because he's not he's not my pet or <laughs> I mean, yeah. he kind of is an animal. So <laughs> <laughs> not even. <laughs> I'm, no, I'm kidding. No, but no, he's not. I'm not his owner, and he's not. He doesn't own me. So, I, I don't think I'm toxic. And I, don't I don't think, think neither of us are toxic. Because if we were toxic, I don't think we would be together, honestly. Well, yeah, I think we if we were both toxic, we would be with each other. Yeah, maybe Just then, but... we would be so dumb about it. Yeah. But, um, but... And then I, I think another word to, like, say toxic, but less, like, that word, I think is jealous. And I think the, the one that's jealous is... Is you because yeah I think so I mean I don't I tend not, not, I tend not, I tend to not really I try not to be just because there's no reason to be jealous I um, mean it is not just it's not because I get annoyed of it it's just because at a certain time like he doesn't have to be like no one has to be jealous of anyone because you know what you have exactly so like uh, it really I just mean, happens I guess. Well, yeah, I mean, sometimes I think we both can be jealous because some girls just don't know how to. And guys, too, they don't know how to respect and they just don't care. And Yeah, that too. But that's um, about it, no? No. No? Uh, what's the your baby's guys, name? What's your guys' screen, screen time? No, we use, like, almost the same amount of screen I time. I think his screen time is, like, six hours. And mine's just like, like seven or eight, no? No, mine's eight. And it's just because I watch a lot of YouTube. <laughs> yes, it's all mine's I watch. Six hours of playing games and And yeah. mine is just like talking to my sister and <laughs> and <laughs> like some friends sometimes. More lazy but... in the morning. Um I think I'm the more lazy because I can sleep all day. Like, <laughs> Before I got pregnant, I could sleep morning. He knows because in the morning he'll be he would be up like at eight, and I wouldn't be up until like eleven, twelve. Yeah, not twelve, eleven, yeah, eleven, it's 12. eleven. When I would get mad at you, yeah, I would. <laughs> you would be awake and you wouldn't text. <laughs> no, yeah, I would ever. Anyways, <laughs> um, but yeah, I think I um, I think I'm more lazy in the morning because especially now because like I'll sleep super late. And then, no, well, it's because I get hungry at night. Yeah, I should get hungry randomly, and then we'll have to, I'll have to get up and go. Or we'll <laughs> both. We'll both. <laughs> Most of the time, she's kind of lazy and, and won't get up to I don't. Get. The reason I don't get up is because I'm scared. She's scared, but there's light. You can get up. <laughs> there's no, no. Um, Anyways, yeah. yeah that's... So, I think I'm more of a lazy person, the lazy one in the in the morning because. I, like, want to sleep until, like, 12. And it, that's not good because we're not productive. Yeah. And right now, 
we can't really be we can't really do anything but but i mean we try to I, we try to go on walks and yeah like, I, I just feel like i think in any even though like we can't do anything it's still like not good to wake sleep up so much wake up to like or get out of bed until like one or one or like late you know because you kind of just feel lazy throughout the whole day like the whole day just doesn't seem right and i don't like that I, yeah so i think i have to um work on that because mm. that's yeah. in one of our goals for <laughs> my goal um and it says that's the last what's one, the huh? baby's name gonna be more. so whoever doesn't follow us on any of the social medias um we announced we announced our baby's name and um the gender um like christmas time and um we're having a boy and we're gonna name it after after me so it's gonna be mauro jr um no garcia no we're not putting garcia or mendoza we're just gonna be the uh, the last name is gonna be unknown um we don't know yet <laughs> no we're um <laughs> We'll, we'll put both our last names. Um, and... We're still debating on that. Just we'll... No, not... <laughs> what? Like... <laughs> not that we're not going to put his last name, but my last name just because I think like, it's... it's just too long. I mean, I would want to, but since he's going to be a junior, then I'm not sure. I mean, probably, yeah, but like... We'll so, see. I mean, we'll yeah. figure it out. I mean, just I'm pretty sure debate. we will put we'll Mendoza. We'll vlog. <laughs> Um, we'll make a vlog we'll vlog we'll make up a vlog out of it um but yeah um, um i think that's it no we still have one. no we don't yes we do um when did he raise me um, see that's everyone everyone's to know when we met and that's about it explain oh no that's <laughs> Never mind. Um, there's just some questions that a little inappropriate. Yeah. People kind of want to know a little too in detail. And about... it's it's a family channel, so <laughs> we don't. Even we don't... though he was cussing. Something. I mean, yeah, I'm sorry, but but it's it's alright. We'll um, we'll edit it out. So, um, anyways, yeah, I think that's gonna wrap it up. Um, thank you to everyone that um, sent us questions. Um, and yeah, we'll we'll. Um, try and do a little more of these kind of videos or little different videos. Just we wanted to just introduce ourselves and um, but that's about it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and um, like it, subscribe.